Mrs. Bonneville, where are we? Um, we're on Narrowboat Love Life Trail, and I've just got up and very sorry. <laughs> and uh, behind us, you may be able to see um, quite a few packing boxes. Um, what are we doing today, Mrs. Bonneville? <laughs> we're moving on to Chow Bella. Lots to update you on. We got the wide beam. We're moving. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, folks, apologies for the sweaty face. Just finished unpacking, sorry, unpacking, packing up and moving off uh, now about Love Life Triumph. Um, sad times, Mrs. Bonneville's not with me because she's over um, with her sister, um, not recovering from operation, but just having a few more days because her wound um, hasn't quite healed um, yet. So I didn't want her anywhere near the boat because she's such a doer, God bless her. She'd be lifting boxes, but we had our really, really great friends, best friends actually, Neil and Paul from um, Wide Beam Goldfinch help us. Thank you. You're an absolute pair of your legend. So yeah, the boat. Let me just uh, flip the camera around. Hold on a minute. So there it is, guys. Narrow boat, love life triumph. <laughs> All empty, ready for the new owners. We've left a, a little card for them just to welcome on board with a few notes in terms of what we've kind of left. Um, we've left some coal for them because the nights are getting a little bit cold so uh, they can start their, uh, their wood burner and a few other bits and pieces. But yeah, it, uh, it seems strange. Sad times. Sad times but good times. Yeah, obviously we've left the microwave for them and that was the cooker that needs to be changed because of the boat's safety. Um, yeah, you're more than welcome to that. We never... We never really agreed with that being swapped out, but there you go. Yeah, sad times, sad times. Let's just switch some lights on here. Uh, oh dear. There we are. <laughs> There's the bed. <laughs> Obviously, we've put the bed um, back. We've pushed it in. So the new owners can do what they want with that. Very sad. Sad to see it go, or sad to be leaving the boat. But uh, we had some really fantastic times in here. We put a whole 30 minutes on the engine, because as you know, we are um, floaters, not boaters. <laughs> but yeah, love life triumph. See you later, girl. You take care of yourself. And look after our new owners, because you looked after us really well. Just make sure we close the fridge. Yeah. We've left electricity. We've left plenty of electricity for the new owners because we're not quite sure when they're coming to uh, to move in. But uh, yeah, there you go. There it is. Yeah, there we go. Let's put the cratch down for the last time. Zip her up. Yeah. As I say, wherever she goes to, or whoever's bought her, I should say, is buying a great boat. Don't let anyone say otherwise. It's a Tyler Wilson hull. It might not be the best fit out or the fit out that people like, but that's, we bought it because we like the quirkiness of it. Um, but it's a great boat. Narrow boat, love life triumph. Oh, folks, just got on. Oh, sorry, I'm so tired. Just got on to Chow Bella, sorry about the lighting. But uh, we've just got on, and <laughs> actually, let me just turn the camera around and show so, you what's what. Yeah, <laughs> put the chairs up now. Obviously, this is not what it's going to look like. I'm just literally putting chairs up. Mrs. Bonneville isn't here this weekend. She's at her sister's, as I said earlier. I didn't want her around because she's such a doer, Mrs. Bonneville, and she's still recovering from a, a surgery she had um, about a month, six weeks ago. So please, please don't think this is what the boat's going to end up looking like. We're just... I'm just literally putting up chairs um, so I can sit down because 
the TV, the main thing. Oh, I don't know. What am I doing here now? Oh, dear, dear, dear. Oh. Oh, what's that saying there? To use his feet. Oh, God. No. There we go. Right, so TV's on. <laughs> the chase or the quiz programs are available. That is an absolutely enormous TV. So let me just show you what's in front of me. So <laughs> the Dyson is on, uh, and so far so good with that. Amazing, because the boat's not even furnished, and um, it's really, really warm in here. Well, I think it is. So these are just a few of the boxes that uh, I've got to unpack. Let me just take you up onto um, the back deck and show you. Oops, a daisy. <laughs> there you go, folks. Look at all that. That's our back deck. Ah, oh, dear me. <laughs> oh, it is an absolute nightmare. Sorry about the lighting. So, yeah, um, let me just go back down into the boat. So, the priority this evening for me, <laughs> look at our pots and pans. Yeah, the priority this evening for me, folks, is to um, get the bed made. Let me just take you through. I really am sorry about all the lighting. I don't know how to switch the lights on <laughs> on the boat. Let's just go into the bedroom. So I've got to make the bed. Oh my god, look, I've got I've got coat hangers. I can actually hang things up. Where's the lights in here? Hold on a minute, people. Where are the lights? Ah, ah, there we are. We have lights. So yeah, make the bed. Oh god, that is an enormous bed. So yeah, make the bed, put those clothes away um, and sit down and relax. And then tomorrow, as I say, I'm gonna start to unpack all this. I'm not gonna show you that because it's, well, it's boring. Next time you see the boat will be with beautiful Mrs. Bonneville on board. Um, that's the only thing that slightly spoiled it today, um, that she couldn't be here with me this evening. But as I say, I didn't want Mrs. Bonneville doing any lifting because I say she would never listens to me right so there you go priority one captain's chairs are up and that space there eventually is where we're going to have our l-shaped sofa priority two sit down in a minute and watch a little bit of that enormous tv and priority three um is make the bed they're in the wrong order aren't they <laughs> right folks we will i will sorry i will see you once all this madness is unpacked Ta -ta. Bye.